Today I'm going to swatch my Aquarius watercolors from Roman Schmal. I have here the try out set. Here are only five colors inside, but do not be afraid. It will not be only these five colors because I have a bunch of them. I'm going to swatch all of these ones and I have four more to add. And yeah, first I have to open all of them because as you see, they are all wrapped. So just give me a second and I will be right back.
So I have decided to buy this set because it was on offer on Arte Miranda and yeah, it was really cheap. Uh, when I calculated, I think uh, I paid two euros per pen and this is a whole pen and usually the price goes from three euros 50 depending where you buy or four even 450 to i do not want to say seven eight euros so the price range is really different for these um, roman schmoll watercolors um yeah so i decided to take this set even though I have one double now, so I have already ordered the Aquarius Green and I have it here, so now I have two of them. Um, one thing I wanted to tell you, yeah, I took them out, so what you get is like this, uh, it's just a plastic box and you get the colors uh, inside, but the colors are not wrapped this nicely, so you do not get this nice white uh, label on top no color number on them or anything they come only wrapped in this aluminium foil so no so this part is not available you only get them in the aluminium foil and they are here inside but that's okay I mean if you pay less and you have less garbage so why not um, that is one thing and another thing you saw it during my swatching is that I had no problem of taking off that uh, additional white um, coverage from the pens which is actually positive for me so none of them was, was sticking I was able to take all of them out and that was really nice and enjoyment so without putting them into the fridge and here is the swatch and yeah i'm i'm definitely so happy with the colors that i bought a little bit maybe maybe i'm thinking i maybe i made a mistake of ordering both of these ones but okay let's start from the beginning so as you can see these colors are so nice um, they are vibrant there, I have a couple of them, for example, this one here and this one, they have the same pigment inside, but as you can see, they are different colors. Um, this one is granulating and it's granulating nicely. It is goetite, I think. And this one um, is also available from Daniel Smith. I do not have that one, but this, this one looks really nice. This one here, I think this was Roman Schmoll Brown. It also granulates, but it is really heavy, this color. Um, I, I don't know how to say it. It was, yeah, you see, I've just put a little bit down and it was so much on the paper. So it is definitely a heavy color. These ones are not granulating, but uh, really nice colors. I'm not so happy with this one um the number 215 well i will have to write all the number all the names as you can see i did keep all 214 that is the wrong one let's see is this 215 here it is uh so 215 that is ultramarine pink well it is a granulating color but um i do not like it well i mean it's just my preference uh it's not not the color which i find so nice maybe i will use it i don't know but um, i'm not so impressed with this one um the next one you saw this one in one of my art hauls i bought it separately it looks so nice you see blue pink purple it's really nice granulation here then this is potter's pink it also granulates um i think for me this was not necessary i bought it before i decided to buy the one from schminke now i have a tube of <laughs> potter's pink and also a pen so a little bit too much for me but um that's okay let's continue so these two ones um two 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 three blue ones they are pretty similar. The difference is minimal. Um, 
I I don't know. I this one this one is maybe a tick darker or not. Nah, I'm I'm not so so sure how to say it. they they look pretty similar. So I think it probably it was not necessary to buy both of them. It's also the same pigment. Um so yeah, if you did decide maybe I think one would be enough. And not both of them as I uh bought them. Um then yeah, with this color you definitely see that there is a white inside, so it is opaque, this one as well. And this one is so nice. This is um Aquarius green and and I just wanted to say that this one could fit so nicely into the forest set of the Schminke Super Granulating Colors. So it is like you have it here, but you do not have it. Like this one is it, it's still, it's here, but you do not have this dark part. And then this dark green, it is like this one, but you don't have, no, no, do not have this brown inside. So it is like a really... A combination and I, I love it what what is it inside py 150 yeah I do not have that one in none of my mixes uh, there is py 43 so the, the corner of this one looks pretty similar to this one PBR 25 I also never used that one and PB 29 PB 29 PBR yeah, no, completely different uh, pigments inside and it looks so nice, this color here. Then we have this one. Um, I think it was olive. I see now that I did not write the pigments. Three, four, five. It is olive green light and it is made of PB29. P Y 129 PY 150 PBR 25 so many different pigments inside it looks nice it looks so nice so I love these two colors like then we have a green one as I said these two are pretty similar I think this was hematite again I have to find modern um, two four eight two four eight and two three nine ah i was searching for for the two three nine but the two three nine is the caput mortum and it's the one that i got in the set yeah now i can now i remember so this is a caput mortum and this one is hematite violet shade Yes, this is the violet shade. They are the same pigments. Um, yeah, it is darker, a bit darker than this one. And this one is more reddish. Yeah, definitely. So they are not the same, but the difference is not so huge. So I think if you want one of these ones, I mean, I think you will be... Uh, happy with only one of them because they are so so similar and the next one is the PBR 730 I just bought this one because it was the cheapest I think 3 euro 20 or something like that um, yeah so this is my set of the Roman Schmoll for the colors I'm not sure maybe sometime in the future I will buy I will buy some other ones but for now i'm actually pretty happy with uh, these colors except as i said for this one and i do not need this one uh, with these ones yeah nice colors and i had maybe with, with two of them i had a little bit of problem of dissolving them but it was just at the beginning um, i actually think it was no, it was not with this one. It was with maybe with this one. It and but beside that, all the other ones uh, reactivated nicely. And as I said, you are getting the whole pen. So and I've put them here. These are my schminke ones. 
So that would be it for my Roman Schmoll watercolor set. Uh, guys, thank you for watching and see you next time. Bye.